So I'm excited for this one. The name alone has got me motivated here. Bat Band? Is like something Batman would use? The Bat Band? There's a thing in the world called the Bat Band and it needs to be here on a desk so I can tell you what it's all about. Ear free, wireless, hearable, hearable, with bone conduction sound. It's being modeled. I was the first choice. I couldn't do it and so they ended up with this. I think it's not that bad, but of course, there it is. Put on your head with the logo in the upright position. Download the app to calibrate. Swipe one finger to bring volume up two fingers for the next or previous track and click it once to play pause and take or end a phone call. That is so strange looking. I mean, it's certainly not headphones. Some light reading with a, an afternoon cup of tea. That's what Jack likes to do. Connect to your virtual assistant. Be social, be social. Jack, do you know how to be social at life? Listen to music and free your ear. Free your ear. I've done videos on bone conduction style headphones before, but they looked more like headphones that wrapped around the back of your neck. This is unmistakable. If, if you see this thing, you're gonna ask some questions. Yes, bat band. I heard something, okay, cool, now. Now there is an app I'm supposed to get as well, so I should probably do that. Bat band by Studio Banana, oh my. The app has a, an average of a 1.3 rating. That's a little rough. Connected, sweet. There's presets. So you can choose between outdoors, indoors, or a personalized preset. Oh, this is cool. All right, so you can also set the microphone sensitivity, balance between the left and right channel. That's it? It just goes like there, like that? It sticks. And it's kind of comfortable too, I don't know. Maybe I don't mind it. You could hide it like, oh, that might be the move. I'm not doing anything, look, I got the ear. All right, let me play the demo track. A lot more vibration than I expected. Oh, the closer you get to the, this is much louder down here. Okay, it's, it's quite a bit louder now. Here's my personalized. Let me create one here. Let's just max it. We just need more. That does not sound great. Let's just do outdoors. You, like you hear this right now. Yeah, you hear this? I mean, you can't be listening to this on an airplane or something. No, that actually sounds better. This sounds way better like this. What it is is the closer this gets to your actual ear, the louder it gets. You know, it bleeds, the sound, the sound bleeds out. So if you get it closer to your ear, the louder that it gets. So I did a video a while back, that was the first bone conduction audio device that I had tried. And the design on those, it kind of brings the bone conduction part up in front of the ear. It, it sits right here. And those are usable. The trouble with these, unless you've got them right over your ears, it's just not loud enough. Maybe that's fine. Maybe that's where you would end up wearing them anyway. The whole premise here is that your ears remain accessible to outside input. You're at the grocery store, you go for the jog. Like I said, you're on the bike. You need to be aware of your surroundings. See, the trouble is if you don't get that correct mix, you end up getting not enough of either. Not enough of your surroundings, not enough of the, the audio that you're wishing you were listening to. Now I felt like with that last pair, it was good enough. But with this, I feel like you're probably giving up too much. Plus I think this thing is expensive. How much is this, Will? $250. You wanna be that. Whatever that is, you wanna be that. Guys, I'm not wearing this. I'm not gonna wear it. It's not happening. If it sounded great, maybe. I kind of like the idea of not having my ears covered when I'm out, but compared to the pair that I tried in the past, they did sound better. And that, I, I think that counts for something. I don't know what to tell you. 250, man, you could get some serious headphones for 250. Like the IQ buds that have microphones in them so you can get some spatial awareness. Tom, say something. Oh. You're amplified right now. I don't know who this is for other than the girl on the box, some kind of a costume. I, I, I mean, that's, I have to try it. I gotta be on the lookout for that new tech. But what I would say is if you're looking for bone conduction, look away from these. I looked at one that's a lot less expensive. I will link it down below in the description, a company called Aftershocks. And that one does a better job for less. Maybe it's for somebody, if that's for you, I wanna know in the comments how you see yourself using that beyond the fact that you're a huge Star Trek fan and, and it's time for you to, to beam, beam off into another galaxy far away.
This episode of Unbox Therapy has been brought to you by the new Honor 7X. And in celebration, you can probably tell I've got seven of them in front of me. That's because courtesy of Honor, we're going to be doing a giveaway. It's happening on my Twitter, so make sure to go follow me there. And now I'll tell you a little bit more about this device. Point two second fingerprint scanner. So it's got something they're calling full view display, which is 18 by nine by default, but then you can utilize that extra space to have a multi window setup, hold down the multitask button. You'll see it'll bring up other things that I've got open. Scroll in Reddit and then just size this up so it's just the right size of the YouTube player. So it could be YouTube along with Reddit or Wikipedia or you could be playing a game along with using a messenger app like WhatsApp or even just a text message. Do two things at once, because you're a busy guy or girl. Now another feature this device has is inside the camera, in which the front facing lens will respond to a gesture. This is kind of cool. If I just hold up my hand, it'll trigger a countdown timer. Are you ready, Jack? Here we go. Look at that, two, one. You see that? I'll do it one more time in case you missed it. Hand up. See what happened there? You trigger a nice little timer, get your pose right, get your beauty mode on. Who's kidding who, Jack? That's, that's some billboard material, that's some Times Square material, some GQ magazine material. This one here has 64 gigs of storage and four gigs of RAM, but you can expand the storage as well. It's got one of those combo SIM card slash micro SD card slots. Now, Honor also told me that this is going to be a value device available for somewhere around 300 bucks. On top of that, we're gonna be giving seven away because it's the 7X. Will he do, ladies and gentlemen? Also, a smartphone delivery guy, so that's a lot of phones. In fact, that's six, this makes seven. We're giving away seven. Shout out to Honor for making that possible. If you wanna participate, go follow me on Twitter. The details will be over there. You could be the happy new owner of one of these Honor 7Xs. Go do it. Do it now.